What's going on guys? Hope you're all having a great day today. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to get PayPal notifications in your Discord server. And this is really helpful for people that sell stuff in their Discord server or want donations or any kind of payment processing through a Discord server. I'm about to show you how using your PayPal, uh, if someone sends you money, you will get notifications on your Discord server to whichever um, channel that you select. So what you want to do first is go to Google or whichever search engine you use and go to make.com and it's going to have you sign up for an account. It's free. There's no credit cards. There's no charging. They do have a premium option but you can just stick to the free version. Uh, and so once you create your account you're going to be put onto a page like this and from here you want to click on create new scenario you're going to click on the purple plus. You're going to type in PayPal. And then you're going to hit new, no new notification. Now you can see there's a lot of other options here. And you guys can play with this if you want to. Uh, for whatever best suits your needs. But for now we're just going to hit new notification. And I already have a webhook. But what you need to do is hit add. And it will create a webhook. And then it will give you this link. You're going to hit copy address to clipboard and then hit this little PayPal IPN settings below. And it's wanting me to verify, so give me two seconds. Alright, so now once here, I have a previous IPN, so I'm actually going to remove that. And you're going to paste, that actually looks like the same link. Um, you're going to paste that link into here and you're going to hit receive IPN settings. So have that enabled and hit save. And that should be good to go. You're going to go back over here, hit OK. Hit add another module and then type Discord. And then from here you're going to hit send a message. Now once again there's a lots of options so you guys can play around with that. And from here you're going to hit add. Now I already have one, but I'm just going to go through this again because it can get a little confusing. It's going to have you first sign in, but then once you sign in, it's going to add the Instagramat bot, which before uh, Make.com, it used to be called Instagramat, so they haven't changed the bot name. But this is the Make.com's bot. You're going to add it to whichever server you want to use it. So I already have that. So I'm just going to go to yeah this one. Then choose a method. You're going to send a message to a channel. You're going to select the channel ID out of your server. I'm just going to go to admin chat. And before we move on, go over to your Discord. And the bot is in the server. That's because I've already added it. But for instance, say I wanted it in... Um, in the log server, for instance, uh, I would go to edit channel, permissions, add members or roles, and you're going to type in <coughs> going to add both of those. Then now all you have to do is scroll down and enable send message permissions. And that's all you have to do, unless you can just give them admin and you don't have to do that but I mean all you really need is send message permissions so then you should be set up for whichever channel just whichever channel you choose in make.com you need to go to that channel in your discord and enable send message permissions so now it will show up off to the side but we're gonna go back to here Then from here you want to create your message <clears throat> so I'm gonna say something like um, new PayPal receipt and in Discord I, oh yeah I swapped the E and the I whoops um, I added these two things in Discord that's gonna make it bold so you guys can do that if you want and then from here you're gonna hit well you I mean you can customize this however you want but what I usually do is first name can't add the last name, but it's not very important. Uh, first name, email, 
and then you're going to click on gross amount that's going to tell you how much they sent and then you can also hit the payment status that's going to tell you if it's been completed or not though i mean if you get a message in your discord it's it's completed so i mean you don't really need that but it's just an extra thing you guys can add whatever you want here so i'm going to get the first name their email the amount they sent and the payment status and just for fun we're also going to bold the gross amount because that's the most important thing so okay so once again what we're doing here is we connected our PayPal for new notifications so every time we get a payment on PayPal it's gonna ping it here and then it's gonna send it over to discord and it's gonna pull or it's gonna connect to our admin chat on our discord server and it's gonna pull the first name the email the gross amount and the payment status back from discord or from paypal and then send it to your discord server so that's pretty much it all you have to do now is turn it on scenario is not saved well then let's save it turn it on it should be on and running so now if you guys will give me one second we'll do a test test run with this All right, so I'm sending one dollar right now. Oh wait, hold on. And send. And just like that, in the matter of you know five seconds, new PayPal receipt, name, email, one dollar, then shows it was completed. Now I got my spacing a little messed up. You can see it's not really not spaced very well. Um, I believe that would be there, so you'd put a space, and then that would fix that. That's that's it. That's how you do it. It's really straightforward. It's really easy. Well, if you're selling anything, I used to sell stuff. I don't really anymore. You know, anyone wants to buy your tools, services, selling video game, whatever's. You know, you have. Your payment options they send it to you and boom it pops in the channel no more checking paypal to see if you get it um so that's that's it if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to drop a like if you guys want me to do more integrations with make.com drop that down in the comments below and as you guys see i mean there are whoops that's not what i want there are hundreds if not thousands of different websites you can connect this to so really, I mean, you got use Facebook. I think there's YouTube, Instagram. So you guys can play around with this. I mean, you don't just have to be Discord and PayPal. Whatever suits your guys' needs. And also, this isn't a sponsored video. Make.com is not giving me money unless they want to give me money, and that's fine. Um, but yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace out.